I'm Tara with Tara Simon Studios, and today I'm going to be reacting to my favorite musical of all time, Les Miserables, and this is one of the key cornerstone songs in, this, in the whole musical, Bring Him Home, and this is a special edition. Uh, this is Live From Home, quarantine style, sung by Alfie Bo, John Owen Jones, and the Barricade Boys, and more. Here we go. Very excited about this. Live, of course. Alfie, that placement. In my I can't tell if it's because of his house, how echoey it is, you hear the room noise, right? I can't tell if the need was under, like, flat, or if it was just the room noise. In my need, you have always been there, is the melody. And I'm going to back it up so that you guys can hear, and you tell me in the comments what you think. I, I want to say it's room noise. He's so good. I mean, that head voice placement up there is just stellar. Let's back up a little bit more. He starts on. I think it's just room noise. Gorgeous. Oh, there is beautiful. Totally different tone, but beautiful still. Ramen. Oh, spinning. Okay, now if you had to guess which one is the lower and which one is the higher, we're gonna listen to it one more time. Look also at their mouth placement, guys. I mean, these are beautifully trained vocalists here. Instead of home, where it's easy to move all over the place. I mean, Simon's mouth is his lips are completely relaxed. Home, it's that gorgeous, nice lotus. And Scott's got a little bit poochier of lips, oh, but he's also singing a different part. And which one do you think it is? Let's listen one more time. Prime is in here, and then. I'm not gonna say anything. You guys can hash it out in the comments. He's like the sun I might have known. Ooh, David. The summer's die one by one. How soon they fly on and on. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! This four part harmony in my miss. This is like ah, mind blown. And all of them are so beautifully trained that their their vowel placement just blends so nicely one with the other. And their cutoffs are just gorgeous as well. I almost even feel like their vibrato is lining up. Like the stars and vibrato are aligning. It's just, huh. can we listen to that part again? I'm such a nerd. I know, I can't help myself, but wow, it's so good. The summer's die one by one. How soon they fly oh. on and on. <laughs> and I I love his musical intonation, so good. Okay, I could almost cry listening to that man. I mean, that, every single one of them are amazing, right? But this Mr. Owens, I mean, you are, can we listen to him one more time? I mean, his, the richness and the placement of his vowels and the, the dynamics that he has in his voice, 
that is what I'm used to hearing. And this, like when I think of the song, that's, that's what I hear. And also the emotionally chargedness of the way he's singing is just incredible. Let's listen to him again. Watch his mouth. Ooh. sang on the M. That's a huge thing for me. Bring him home. Adding an M-A-H instead of home, which sometimes can sound like ho, if you're not careful. Home. <laughs> he did a great job with the ma. Let's listen one more time to that. That's so good. his last note first of all that is it's like what I call a, a, a baking note okay what do I mean by that when you bake uh, it's not just like dump an eyeball right you have to like measure things and that it's it's like a baking note for me because you have to use just enough support and space to start the note but not too much because you want it to be ever so wilty, ever so soft, ever so intimate. And too much, oh, it's just, it loses everything. Even though it's a pretty note, it's not what that last note is meant to be. The last note is meant to be like, like almost like a, a solemn, quiet, inward cry. You know, you're, you're praying to God, right? It's that inwardness. And too loud and too overt makes it lose that completely and so there's this very fine line like granular line between too much and too little but if you give too little then the sound sputters out like oh, oh. and it's it like tries to start but it doesn't have enough so then mid attempt you have to give more that's not what we want so you have to know your voice so well in that moment to be able to nail it the first time oh, and spin forever like he did I mean, that's, that's true artistry right there. So good. These, these gentlemen are stellar. I, I loved Alfie Bo and John Owens, I think the most, if I'm having to pick favorites, which I don't have to, thank God, because they're all amazing. But man, I mean, those two guys for me really hammered home the tonality and the diction and the emotional delivery of what I expect out of a Jean Valjean and Les Mis. Um, Another person that comes to mind who's not in this is Dave Clemens, who was one of the uh, actual um, roles on Broadway and who's who's a longtime friend of mine. Hi, Dave. Uh, if you haven't heard him sing this, look him up on YouTube too. He's amazing. But this I thought was really cool to react to because there are a lot of different greats in this uh, particular Bring Him Home at Home rendition. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. I'm such a musical theater geek. If you guys have some musical theater things that you would like me to see and react to, I would love to hear about it in the comments box below of any of my reaction videos. Only comment there. It's the only place we look. And if you are someone who loves musical theater and you're like, oh my gosh, this is speaking to my soul. How do I do this? Let us help you at Tara Simon Studios. We offer voice lessons and have taken many people from bad to good and good to great and great to 
Broadway, okay? So check us out. We will be happy to help. There's a description box below with all sorts of links to help support you on your vocal journey. We hope to see you in sessions or in a course or in an Insta reaction very soon. I love you guys. I'm proud of you. You know that I love this channel and I love giving to you guys all the information and um, any kind of wisdom that I can share. I will. Um, thank you for being the best part of my channel. Be kind to others today. Spread love, not germs, and faith, not fear. And with that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.